right so in this video we are going to be taking a look at mobile security framework so in short mob sf so it is a project of open security.in and it is an automated static analyzer and dynamic analyzer for uh, android and ios apps and um, the dynamic analysis is only provided for ios apps so oh, oh sorry for android apps so this is a really cool project and it saves a lot of time so you can simply uh, go ahead and install it and use this to scan any android apk so what you need to do is uh, go ahead and go to mobsf.github.io slash docs i will be providing this link down in the description so over here just go to mob SF docker options and over here we are going to install using docker as it is the most efficient way of running uh, mob SF uh, because it requires a lot of dependencies and uh, it is good for uh, static analysis but uh, doing dynamic analysis on mob SF is pretty tricky and is not that reliable so it is most uh, I mostly use it for static analysis and then do dynamic analysis later on manually so let, uh, what you need to do is just copy this docker command and if you don't already have docker installed in your system you can do watch my previous video and I have covered how to install docker on your macOS system so just go to Terminal and paste this command, and it is going to pull you the latest uh, uh, public release for Mob SF framework that is uh, available on Docker Hub. So, as you can see, I already have a latest image uh, of Mob SF framework on my system. So, in order to run this, uh, what you need to do is just copy this command over here and paste it in your terminal and it is going to run mob sf for on your docker container and give you the endpoint url where you can access the mob sf uh, web interface so as you can see it is just configuring all the environment settings for mob sf so that it can run uh, without any problems and now as you can see uh, the web service is running and you can access it on local host port 8000 and i'm just going to copy this and open it in the terminal and as you can see uh, i have the web interface and over here i can just uh, select any apk file that i want to scan i don't have currently any APK downloaded on the system and going over to recent scans you will see all the scan uh, APKs or IPA files that we have scanned over here and this is a static analysis and you can find your APA documentation over here so you can uh, use this remotely and use the RESTful API in order to upload uh, any APK for scanning and retrieving scan results so it is pretty handy uh, so that you can uh, set up a remote server where you can uh, send your APKs for analysis and so that you don't put too much load on your system and to check the performance of your Docker container, what you can do is uh, open the Docker uh, click on Docker icon and click on dashboard, and uh, it will show you the container that you are running and it will show all the logs and stats uh, related to that Docker container. And if you want to stop it, you can do it here. And if you want to restart it, uh, you can also uh, do it just by clicking over here. So that's it for this video. If you have any questions, do comment down below. In next video, I will be covering how you can 
use an APK and scan it in MobSF and we view the scan results. So stay tuned for that. And that's it for this video and thanks for watching. And do like this video and subscribe to our channel. It really helps us grow our audience and help more people on the way.